Well, everybody, welcome back to the channel. Uh, we're back out here on Mark Twain Lake trying to catch some of these uh, Mark Twain Lake eater crappie. Probably gonna catch a lot of nine to 10, 10 and a half inch crappie today, just to let you know. Uh, we might catch the occasional decent fish, but uh, the way it's fishing right now, it's just, there's a lot of them good Mark Twain Lake eaters, as I say, but uh, anyway, uh, we're gonna check a couple areas of the lake. I got a guide trip tomorrow, so I'm just, kind of out looking around see what I can find uh, get some uh, different areas in case one area don't pan out so stay with us and uh, let's go catch some fish well there's a nine incher a nine inch fish we're not gonna keep any today I don't think oh, that's a nice fish there he come out and swiped at it well, there's another Mark Twain Lake Eater right there going back in the water. Fun fish to catch though. Another nine inch fish. Man. Finally bit, we put it right on him. We can get two in a row. That's the next thing. Try to get two in a row to bite. There's another one. There's two in a row. Just a nine inch fish right there. trees always produce for me a eater right there if a guy was wanting to keep some fish I guess maybe might be pushing nine pushing it maybe dink Dinks on this tree. Feels like a little better fish right here. Yeah, that's a little better one. That's a little better one right there. Well, that's a little better fish than we've been catching today. Probably a 10 incher. There's some on this horizontal lay down right here, so uh, we're gonna see if we can catch a couple more like that. Just nothing big, but just probably solid 10 incher. That group's right here, if you can see it. There's my jig going down. I'm gonna stop it. Just kind of let it float in there and just see what they do. There's one right there. He popped it. If you all saw that. That's a little better fish. Yeah. That's a better fish right there. Yeah, look at that one. Biggest one of the day right there. Man. Like I said, the biggest one of the day right there. That's probably 10 and a half inch fish. Might put a couple of these in a live well, get some pictures. We might end up taking a few home. I got a new Bubba blade uh, fillet knife at home. I need to try it out anyway. So, so I'm gonna put this one in the box. See if we catch any more like it. There's another one. That's another better one. Oh yeah. That's what we want, right? 
right there. There's another better fish. There's a group of them down here. Oh. If I don't put him back in the water, but we'll put him in a live well. See if we can catch a few more. Here we go. Yeah. Found him roaming. He's not very big. He's just a solid nine inch fish. Probably close to it. That's an eater crappie right there, boys and girls. Just another nice nine incher. I've switched to the old uh, pink dwarf strike three fishing signature series pillhead with that Jason's Cajun Cricket wall bash from Wild Willie's OCD. There you have it. Just another small fish. Like it's all we're catching up here. So I might go look for another little area. I know there's plenty of plenty of eaters up here to catch. If a guy wanted to come up here and catch a bunch of flares, skillet fish. Yeah, well, let me know. Find anything up there. I'll call you later. I ain't going up that far. I only got to about 3 o'clock. Holler at me. All right, buddy. But he ain't going to make the cut. Smaller fish. A little better crappie. About a nine incher. I might keep a few today. Heck, have a little Super Bowl crappie maybe. Why not? Just remember the Super Bowl Sunday. Why not? There's a fish right there that's kind of sitting by this tree. Let's see if I can get him to play. He looks, all right. looks okay. And he got it. He got it. Let's see how big he is. Oh yeah. I don't know. He probably ain't gonna cut it. No, he's not quite big enough to flay, but eight and a half incher. Straight down here. I'll just play with these for a second. There's one right there. About the same size. But he's going to get a pass today. That's a decent nine inch fish right there. Go in the box for a little Super Bowl treat right there. All right, we moved down the bluff here and found another school of fish and we're just gonna see if they wanna eat. Come on. Got that one. He come out there and flopped it. Yeah, it's a better fish. Right off that cedar. Look at that one. Man. Just a Mark Twain Lake eater. Yeah. He go in the skillet.
There's a better one. There's a little better one there. He's just a nine, but he might go in the skillet, get some Super Bowl treats. Try that new Bubba blade out. Throw it in the box. Got my buddy Trey over here, sharing the hole with him. He was on the last video. Look at all them fish. Well, I hope everybody enjoyed that little video. Just kind of a little scout trip today for a guide trip I got tomorrow. But uh, had some fun, caught some fish, you know, a lot of smaller fish. Uh, that's just the way it goes right now. That's the way Mark Twain's fishing. Anyway, it's about three o'clock. I've got to put the boat in the shop and get these fish um, in the refrigerator. And then I am going to clean them probably in the morning because uh, I've got a basketball game tonight. But So thanks again for watching Strike 3 Fishing, and uh, we'll see everybody on the next video.